Mixing. Switch to the mixing board by clicking the mixing board icon in the control panel section. The mixing board may seem familiar to you. That's because it's styled after standard hardware consoles. The horizontal track order mirrors the track order in the sequence editor. Each track is represented as a vertical bar called the channel strip. Focus on the fader and meter section. This is one of the most important sections on a channel strip simply because it allows you to control the overall volume of a track. Use the pan knob for placement in the mix. If you want to hear a specific track more in your left ear, turn the pan knob to the left. If you want to hear it more in your right ear, turn it to the right. In this section of the channel strip, you can solo or mute different tracks. Solo a track to instantly isolate it in the mix. Mute a track to take the track out of the mix. You can also arm or monitor tracks by using the record enable and input monitor buttons, just like how we discussed in one of the previous videos.